think it's safe to say that we've moved into the next phase of the fishing season here in Iowa. Uh, last week, the first full week of November, the temps just plummeted. Um, we hit record lows yesterday, or close to it anyway. So water temps obviously have followed the air temps. Uh, so really at the cusp here between the fish, which have been sort of staging to prep and get ready for their winter behavior to now like fully transitioning to the winter game. So it could be kind of a challenge out here today. Um, the target species is, is channel cats. I'm going to see if I can get on some catfish. Um, you know, they haven't really had time to acclimate to the, to the dropping temps, but that's the challenge. So uh, pretty much going to stay on a pretty solid, predictable winter pattern here. Uh, I'm out in the vicinity of deep, deep hole. Um, and I'm going to start off by fishing some of the shallow ledges uh, in the area and work my way towards the deeper hole. Um, you know, downsize all the gear, downsize the hooks, downsize the bait. Um, we'll set on the spots uh, a little bit longer than I normally would in warm weather and we'll just slowly move towards the hole and see if uh, I can come across some fish in, in the process. Well, we're about to get on the board here. Not a bad one at all. Here we go. Not a bad start. Not a bad start. Get on some fish. He has been caught before. <laughs> this size, this size okay. This size okay. He can still see. Old one eye. Old one eye. We're gonna let him go back in the water. I'm sort of in the easy spot here. This is the place I'd like to sit and catch fish and um, moving closer to the hole takes me a little bit of paddling. So with any luck, I'll be able to sit here and stay on some fish. We'll give it a bit longer here. Not a bad way to kick things off. That move paid off. Move to another spot. Oh, move to another spot. And, oh, I almost doubled up there. Move to another spot over here and haven't been here five minutes. And that's perfect eater fish. Let him go. See ya. better than that one. This was a little bit better. Easy. Death 
old bonanza. You're not bad at all. Not bad at all. Alright, in you go. In you go. Alright, well, I'm definitely going to say, am I still on here? We're definitely going to say the move paid off. Uh, so, right, this side is on the north side, so it's going to get more sunlight. This little cove is going to be a little bit warmer, and it's closer to the deep hole. So it really had, you know, on paper, it, it just, it was better all the way around. It was something I definitely felt like I had to try. So I came over here um, and appeared to, at least for the moment, be on them. So... <laughs> this was not very big, but man, he's got some spunk. I give him that. He's got some spunk. Some spunk. He's not a bad fish at all. No. I mean, if you're gonna come out, if you're gonna come out on a day like today. With a week like this that we've had, with these plummeting temperatures, and you catch fish like this all day, you gotta be pretty happy about that. There's no complaining about that. This one's got some fight. He feels like he might be an all right fish. Pretty solid fish right there, folks. That is a real nice fish. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> yeah, too much to drink. <laughs> We've been swimming into something. Let's get this guy back in the water. Let's get him back in the water. Here you go, bub. And away he goes. Just like we like it. Yeah, that was pretty good stuff. Give me an opportunity to. Like I mentioned earlier, everything is downsized. Just running an ounce weight and a liter and small four aught J hook. I'm gonna re hook this just a bit. Very diminutive. And then on the other rod, uh, like I said, I've got the. Running the Whisker Seeker Weighted Float, this is more neutrally buoyant, and then a uh, little rubber core sinker down by down by the hook so that it uh, keeps the bait down in the water. I've got some current here, and I don't want yeah, you just haven't done it. I don't want the bait being pulled up up towards the surface from the current, so the the little sinker helps keeps it uh, helps keep it down. Super simple, super straightforward. The deep hole, the current seam, right by a ledge up into shallower water. And I'm just on the slack side of that current seam up on the up on this, this shelf in this cove. And so far so good. 